Hey guys, um, today I have a Jane Davenport haul. Um, <clears throat> I'm kind of bummed out because I filmed this video last week where I did the unboxing from Michaels. They had a huge sale. Everything was like 40% off or more on all the Jane Davenport items. So I filmed the unboxing. I showed everything. Um, it was really cute. And I don't know what happened, but after 20 seconds, my camera stopped and I didn't realize it because I didn't go and edit it right away. And all I really have is me opening a box. <laughs> so, I've already taken everything out, opened it all up, and started using it. So, we're just going to kind of start at the beginning because um, I, I can't get that film back. But I'm going to show you what I got because I'm really excited. Um, for me, Jane Davenport started with this book that I bought like three years ago, Beautiful Faces. I was buying it for um, my art journals because I was really big into art journals before I got really big into coloring. But I still, you know, my passion is um, <clears throat> journaling. So I thought, let me get some of these while they're on sale because I, I just, they're so beautiful. I had to get um I had to get one or two and, and just try them out. So let me put some of this to the side and then I'll, sh I'll show you what I got. First off, the first thing I bought are her paints. They're so beautiful. Um, this one is the Bright Palette. Let's see if you can see it. Yeah, there we go. Get out that light. The colors are so beautiful. They come individually wrapped. And they have this little face on each, you can see it. They have a little face on each color. But I cut the little face out and I glued them onto the little swatch area because it's the exact same color. It just made my life easier. So these are so beautiful. They're so bright and vibrant. I will be doing a, um, a swatch video comparison on them soon. I just really started getting to play around with them. This one is the Glitzy pattern. The Glitzy. Really nice. And you can take them out and you can move them around. And I like how this folds up. And they even have the little finger thing like this. The little, so you can paint with it and hold it up like a palette. And then the gold one is the neutral, neutral palette. And I've used this one a few times already. I really like all of the face tones that they have in this one. They don't look anything like the color palette. That's why you got to keep these swatches. All right, these were, um, man, I think I got these for like seven bucks each. They were very inexpensive so <clears throat> that was really really good and one of the next things I bought was her incredible pen which um, it is really nice but it does to me it seems like it runs out of ink fairly quickly um, it kept stopping up on me but um, I went and I read, I mean, I watched her video about how to clean it and take care of it properly and everything. So I think um, it's doing a little better now. It writes really well. And I do like that if you, if you do a face, you know, say you're doing a face and you want to watercolor that face. Look at that. So I have done some really cool stuff with this um, water soluble ink. Don't you love that face? It's gorgeous. <laughs> okay, let me put that out the way. So yeah, you get um, I think you get four or five refills with it, and it's very easy. You just open it up. You put your little capsule in here till you hear it click and then you put this back in and they also give you a a re 
ref um, not a refill, but this you can use if you have your own ink. You know, say you have your own ink at the house and you want to use your ink. You can put this in there and pull it up almost like a, I don't know, like a suction thing and, and, and fill your ink up with this and use it to put it in there. Um, the next thing I bought was this. This is for the, um, you know, the, the little band. You can add more um, books to them and everything because they only come with one or two bands, I believe. And this also came with um, the little, the little keychain thing, but it keeps falling off. I don't know if it's just too heavy. I tightened the ring and everything, but I just it keeps falling off. So I just had to take it off for now to figure out what I'm gonna do with it. But yeah, um, it comes with three colors. They have different um, keychains with different colors, but this was my favorite, so I went ahead and picked that color. What's next? Oh, I got the washi. I got the face tastic washi. And let me see what other ones I got. You got the eyes, noses, women. Lots of face pieces, which I really think is cool. And I have them all on a sheet. I'm going to show you all in a minute, but just showing you how they come all different shapes and sizes. I love this one with all her girls. And then this one with all the eyeballs. Let me get those out the way. The only problem I'm having with their washi, it's once it's very hard to get up. I was having a time. So once I do rip a piece off, I kind of leave it hanging like that open because I had such a hard time getting them all um, started. You know, I was ripping up a lot of tape. <clears throat> Alright, the next thing I bought was this, like a pencil book, which is so pretty. I love her art. It's just so gorgeous. I think I paid under $2 for this. And, um, I'm going to be getting the mermaid markers. Those are coming in, and I think I'm going to put them in here if they fit. I'm not sure how long they are, but um, I think I'm going to put them in here. For right now, I've, I've just been stuffing the napkins of hers that I bought. I have been pulling them apart for collage, and I learned the hard way that there is another piece here that you have to pull off. I didn't realize that they were double ply, so... Um, they're really, really pretty. Her faces are on here. And once you use um, some gel medium or Mod Podge or whatever you're going to use, it just melts into the background. It's really nice. So I'm really enjoying doing that. <clears throat> so I got that. And then I bought, I originally bought this book. And I liked it so much. I said, it's so pretty. I'm going to go back and get another one. So I got this one. It's the same on the back. <clears throat> it comes with, it didn't come with this um, particular book. Oh, I bought the pockets too. And I just put one in this book. And, and then I bought, someone sent this one to me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Someone sent this one to me, and someone sent this one to me, and I think that um, I think I'm gonna use this one since I I did have two already. I think I might use this one as a giveaway, but I'm not sure about that yet. So um, stay tuned for that. Um, I, if I do it, I'm probably going to announce it on my, um, either on here or on my Instagram, which is also Orion's Girl 93. So, okay. All right. This is the, this is the one I bought. Um, the second one I bought, cause I just thought it was so beautiful. Um, I had to have it. This is where I keep putting the keychain. And it just keeps popping off. So I'm going to have to figure out what to do with that. 
Um, this is what the back looks like. And when you open it up all the way, this is what it looks like. I think it's so, so stunning. So, <clears throat> let's just do a quick flip through. I haven't really done much except put a few things down in the background so far. So, um, this is the first pocket. My favorite pocket, so I put that in there. Oh, and I also have in the pocket some little um, stickers that I bought also that are hers. I used a few of them already, <clears throat> so I'm just keeping them in here for now. <clears throat> I bought that with the haul as well. These are some rub-ons that I have used. And these are the books that come with them. These really nice, thick, heavy-duty um, card stock books. They're really easy to work with. This is just uh, some of the napkins that I put down, her collage papers and some of the tape. And I'm going to like draw on it, journal on it, or you know, whatever. More, um, more of her um, collage papers. I was just trying to get some backgrounds going, you know. And then I got another pocket here with another rub on. Pockets come in handy for sure. This is the other side of this pocket. And that's all in the first band. And I did make another band here. So I'm going to probably when I um, need to, um, I'll put another. Um, I'm not sure what you call these. Another book. I know that's not what they're called. But I'll probably put another one of these in there. Let's see where else. <coughs> Okay, this is the first page I actually started playing around with. Um, this, of course, is Jane Davenport's um, um, collage papers. I put the rainbow one down first, and then I put one of her face one on top of it, and then this is just some tape. And then I drew, I put some of her collage papers down, let it dry, and then I just tried to do a, um, a face over it. I'm just learning faces. I'm just really trying to practice, but the hair's terrible. <laughs> but I like how her face turned out. And I used the incredible pen. I'm just having fun, y'all. I'm just trying to play around. I'm shaky today. Is my hands shaking? All right, let's see. Here's another pocket. It's really pretty. I love the pockets. You get three in a pack. All right, and here's another a collage piece that I did with some more of her tape. I like to tape the um, the middles so there's no ink or anything going through. There's another one, and um, we have some of the uh, mouth washy going here up the middle. So I can journal over here. I'll probably paint over here or draw whatever I want to do. I'm going to try to use this for a lot of my um, faces and things that I'm learning how to draw. Okay, this is all. Okay, this is all of her washi that I have so far. So let me get you a little closer so you can kind of see them. They are very, very beautiful. I've seen a lot of people um, put down like a face piece a mouth and then they draw from it and like that was really neat I don't think I have anything else on here left okay yeah, I did this I was trying to see how the collage would work um I bought these books separately and went into see it was really thin but um it worked well I was surprised so I'm probably going to go back over here and journal on here or draw something I like how it just blends right into the paper and I think that's it so far in this book. And the last thing I have is the, they, she calls them journal tattoos. So you get four sheets of the journal tattoos, which are rub-ons. And I'm definitely going to save this piece and use it in my journal, cut it up. 
I also saved this was from the packaging from her collage papers and I haven't decided if I'm going to cut it up or use it however I'm going to use it but I'm going to um, put it in my book somewhere maybe make an insert with them but these are the four that I have so far that I haven't used you get some really cool ones like this unicorn I think I already pulled out a whole one and used the whole one yeah I think she is beautiful this one says moon magic and you a nice crown here a couple of crowns you can draw a face and then put the crown on it and then this is the last one because I already used the other one y'all saw that in the books you got some really nice set of eyes and a nice picture right here and this says and here's nothing I'm sorry and this says and there's nothing we can do to make her change her mind awesome so I think that was it sorry about that goes you know what this is great because I might even um I might even put this whole thing in my book this whole thing put, put it through here rubber band and because the backs that's beautiful to put some color on and then you can paint this with some gesso put some collage papers on it and then you have this whole thing up here you can use oh yeah this will be nice I'm gonna put this right in my book I just thought of that so yeah that'll be nice I'll just insert it right into my book all right guys um I have ordered her her next two books one of them is still on back order since May and I bought it in like March and then she's got another book coming out in June which I pre-ordered I hope I get that in June because <laughs> I ordered it like four months ago so um, yeah the one that's back ordered is fabulous figures I believe it's called so um yeah watch out for this um I really believe I'm gonna give this one away so we'll do a contest on that um, thanks for watching guys I really appreciate it and if you have any questions or comments about the Jane Davenport items or anything that you see just um, let me know and I'll be getting back with you guys with the, um, those swatches for all three of these because they're beautiful wait till you see them um, so yeah, if you have any questions, comments, just leave them down at the bottom and I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Thank you guys for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Bye-bye.